My name is Dennis Conrad. I'm a software development engineer at Microsoft. Today I'm going to go through the conceptual model of the product configuration model. The conceptual model consists of two parts. One is the product configuration model definition concepts and the other is the product configuration model session concepts. The root concept in the product configuration model definition concepts is the product configuration model. The product configuration model will have an association with one component, which is the root component of the model. It may help to view the component, class and category as one concept. The category concept is shared between product configuration and the product catalog feature, which is in the supply relationship management area but it is not surfaced anywhere in the product configuration feature as such. So category can be conceived as a component for this. A component may have zero or more attributes which model different definitions on the component. Each attribute will have a data type and a domain which expresses the possible values that could be assigned to the attribute. A component may have the product requirements model the generic product structure that a product configuration model resembles. Activity requirements model the activities that need to be carried out in order to produce a configured product. Product requirement and activity requirement may have a condition which is modeled by an expression constraint this constraint needs to be true in order for either concept to be included in the generation at configuration runtime. Now let's look at the product configuration model session concepts. The root concept here is the product configuration. There are two deviations of this concept. One is the variant configuration which is produced when successfully configuring a configured product along with a distinct product variant. The other one is a template configuration. The template configuration concept is used to model a template configuration session, which is an essence of partially configured instance of a product configuration model. Session values are modeled using instances concepts. Each component instance may have a parent-child relation to reflect the structure you also see in the definition concepts. Attributes assignments are then modeled using component instance value, instance value, and attribute values. These are the concepts involved in persisting model session data.